is an actress and comedian you know from Barry, Broad City, and The Good Place. Please welcome to The Late Show, Darcy Carden. <laughs> Nice to see you. Nice to see you, too. Uh, now, uh, you, you star in a new TV adaptation of Penny Marshall's classic 1992 movie, A League of Their Own. You got all everything yeah. right. So, <laughs> just to get straight, just to get straight just into so this I here know. for a second, yeah. I'm just curious, when is the first time, you're much younger than I am, I'm Man. just curious what, no, eh. mm. what, when was the first time you saw that movie? I saw it in the movie theater, so that would have been no, wait, 1992. No way, 92. And I was like a real sporty little kid. I was playing softball at the time and sure. basketball and everything. Yeah. And yeah, that was like a really big movie for me. I remember, yeah. I remember, I remember it all. I remember like, it kind of was like the combination of everything I loved in one thing. And I'd never seen anything like it. And it had Madonna and it had sure. Rosie and it had Gina Davis, who's like oh. the prettiest person who's ever lived. Just. Maybe. Amazing. Yeah. I had a real problem. <laughs> I, I had a too. real problem. She had cheekbones you could land the a chopper cheek on. Yeah. Bones. Unbelievable. Quick question, okay. and you'd know after, now that you're in the series. Is there crying in baseball? There is. There is. <laughs> or wait, what, was is I that the tagline? There is. There Just, is. There is. In, there a is league of their own. Business. There is. <laughs> um, now speaking of Gina Davis, you got to spend a little time with her recently, right yes, there. Yes, I oh, did. Oh, you thought I was going to bring no, her out I here? Did. Come on out, Gina. Hey, Gina. Come on out with your. Gina. There you go. So this th th this is you. In the there. cheekbones. There you go. And um, there you go. Also with Abby Jacobson, right? Yes, next on the and other Shante side of her. Adams, who's in League of Their Own, we all um, were pretty starstruck, like I really mega starstruck. Well, you're 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 rare in that uh, you're a you're a comedian who is good at sports. Well, thank you. Well, I mean, this, this, you're like you told me. You you, you <laughs> yeah. know already. Yeah, you yeah. all know that you're good I, at sports. And to what do you owe this? I mean, did you already you already played ball? Yeah. You said. I did, and that's one of the reasons. Like the movie was so important to me too, is because it was like seeing all these girls playing sports and and wanting to be an actor but loving sports. Like I remember really truly when I was a little kid being like, I want to be a professional baseball player and, and an actor and maybe like a rock star. Hey, <laughs> I, yeah. Miss Walsh. Well, you were on improv team. Yeah, yeah. I wasn't huge into the sports. So I was mostly hacky sack. Yeah. <laughs> but... Well, don't don't count hey, yourself out. Hey, man, I'm out. flexible. <laughs> and but I was on improv teams. Yes. And I'm just curious, what is more challenging, <laughs> being on a baseball team or hmm. being on an improv team? They are. They both have their pros and cons. Yes. The funny thing is, like, I would say that I got more injuries playing sports, but I feel like I probably got equal amount playing, doing improv. On stage, all of my, any, I have like a popping jaw, I have a wrist problem, any long time injury I have is mm -hmm. absolutely from and on stage. And you probably had no health insurance. No! You were an improviser. No, absolutely not. I have not. the same thing. Yeah. I have a rotator cuff problem, <laughs> but really? it's not from playing baseball. No. It's from in an improv scene doing front flips. <laughs> exactly. But, because that's what it called and for. And I was gonna say, did it get the laugh? No. No. <laughs> The audience heard me get hurt. Oh, no. And they just went, they, they, they did that. <laughs> and the audience doesn't, like, want you to no, actually no, no, be hurt. No, They don't no. actually like that. Oh, no. Yeah. And it's still a problem? It still wakes me up in the You're middle of the night. You're gonna have to get surgery. I probably will. Yeah. Probably will. I'll just yeah. have the whole thing locked off. <laughs> um, now, because there's, there's, there, you know, baseball you can play recreationally. Me? Like, what? Me or you? Let's find out. Oh. And, uh, Everybody's got a like a baseball you. team. You can't the sport you grew up with, which is found out, oh, is yeah. a little more rarefied. Tell the people what you used to do. Yes. So I played, I grew up in California. I played basketball and softball, and the main sport I played was water polo. Okay. <laughs> Here you go. The anchor. The anchor, middle bottom, right there. There you are. There you are. <laughs> the funny thing about about water polo in this picture is like nobody knows anything about water polo, so I feel like everybody in the audience is like, oh, is that how you play it? Yes. <laughs> That's how you yeah. enter the pool, actually. <laughs> now, is it true that water polo is like, you know, lots of like, you know, tossing and blocking above the water, but yes. below the water, it's just brutal. It really is, it really is. It's like, we're all sort of like angels above the water, and then underneath the water, it is like, 
we would have to wear two bathing suits because one would get ripped. Because you, the, the, the thing you would do is like, wrap your hand around somebody's bathing suit and just pull to keep them down. It's really dark and violent. Wow. And the we pool's kick, deep all over, yeah, right? Yeah, it's deep all over. You're treading water the whole time. I was so strong. Oh my God. Wow. Um, but um, I'm wondering if I should tell you this. Tell it. <laughs> tell it. <laughs> Can't tell okay, I will. Okay. It just I, the thing about it is like I sort of pride myself in like I would rather lose than cheat. I would rather die than cheat. I hate a cheater. I really yes. do. But 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 there was one thing <laughs> in water polo you weren't supposed to have long nails. It was just like one of the ways they tried to like, you know, keep Rain you from being yeah. violent. Yeah. I I was um yeah, I was the captain my senior year. Okay. Yeah. And um <laughs> sorry. And uh, one thing we would have to do before every game is you would go to the edge of the pool, if you can imagine. Uh, I go to the edge of the pool, everybody puts their little hands up and the ref like comes down and checks everybody's nails. I would go to the end of the line, but as captain I knew during the line they were gonna say, captains to the middle, to like shake hands with the other captain. So I'd go to the end of the line and then I would go to the middle of the pool, shake hands with the other captain, and then I'd go to the front of the line and I would just skip the nail check. So I had like talons. <laughs> <laughs> wow. And you just go for their eyes. Yeah, well, go not eyes. eyes. You got to keep it above. So I'd like sh get their. Sorry. Wow. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. Well, uh, we, we don't we don't have a late show water polo team, you should unfortunately. Think about it. But we, we, we do have a baseball team. Go on. And so I wanted to <gasps> grant you uh, as an honorary <laughs> member of the late shows. For real? Yo, honorary late show. This is, we oh. are the, we are the sea captains. Oh, am I a sea captain now? Yes, you are a sea captain. There you go. No. <laughs> For sure, for real. Am I a sea captain? <laughs> Are you saying I could like, if you I was- You can just show up. You can just show up now and play. Okay, I'm oh, going yeah, to. You're a I ringer. I swear to God I'm going to do it. Yeah. You're just going to, you 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 won't know what hits you. Oh. It'll be a baseball. Please hit us. I'm a sea captain. Darcy, you, so sir. nice to meet you. You too. A League of Their Own premieres Friday on Prime Video. Darcy Carden, everybody. We'll be right back. <laughs> 